Hello, Cancer, and welcome to your weekly coffee cup reading for the week of August 15th. I do this week to week, so, you know, I just put a timestamp on there um, so you know which one it is. But um, they can, these, what we, what I read here could come in today um, right away or they're already there. You know, they just can emerge from week to week. Um, I posted the uh, tarot card readings yesterday, so if you didn't see those, go check them out. And um, what was I going to say? I also did, um, oh, I, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, I just had a long day. Um, I po uh, I'm going to be posting them, sorry, I'm so sorry, I get tongue-tied. I don't use scripts, this all just comes from the top of my head, so bear with me. Um, I, I'm going to be posting the tarot card readings on Wednesdays, the um, gem and runestone readings on uh, Thursdays, so, and I did already Monday, so if you didn't um, see that, go check it out. And the coffee cup readings on Friday, so that's my plan for next week. Anyway, let's get on to you for the, for the week of August 15th. Let's see what comes up in your cup. Let's see here. Wow, well, okay. You know, um, there's a sense of, chaos in the home, you more focused on the home, things going in the home, things don't look bad, but there was like, um, like work in the home, things going on in the home. It's starting to shift out, meaning, um, be ready. There's people out there. You're going to be communicating with people from far, either it's on the internet or it's people, they're from a distance or they're just, there's at least four or there's four opportunities coming um i see a bridge here with um one person on one side two people here then another two people i mean you um communication is coming into focus people like wanting to talk to you and i'm seeing that for cancers a lot you know for the readings it's in personal readings it's amazing um showing up here to in general for all cancers um and this is specific messages because there's millions of cancers out there and i'm only reading what i see specific for someone that needs to hear something because other the other stuff it, i feel could be personal reading so um so there's a lot of activity yes in the home and there's a little bit of disruption in the home but um now it's like focusing your focus is going in more in communications um you could have doubts but uh still communicate you need to communicate with some of these people there could be some offerings coming um you could be worried about money like you want money now but there's also a sense of you've completed something and you've accomplished some stuff that you have been working on or you know it's been a little bit of a process but it's saying you know that's good don't get too comfortable keep continuing because there's more to come there's a sense of there is more to come and a sense of saying, be kind of ready for it. Um, let's see what else I see. There's a cup. Kind of change where I'm doing my reading, so it's kind of hard to. Um, oh, yeah. You know, it's like there's a plane here. Either you're going to be, your thoughts are everywhere. You're virtually traveling, but you... You could be traveling. I mean, there's like a wit, there's a plane going out, you know? This could also say you're taking things from one level to a whole different level. There's a sense of completion of some sort, but taking things to a whole different level, meaning, you know, you did 101, now you're, you know what I mean? Since the graduation. Um, there could be opportunities coming and they look like they're good ones stable ones the thing is there's like little blockages on there you need it's like you're thinking about it or it could mean that you need to move or uh, go out um, a location for it or just some sense of that so that could be bothering you but then there is a, a shoe horse horseshoe why do I always say shoe horse that's saying this is good you know this is good and four, four is becoming significant too. Four is becoming significant. And you know, um, with Mercury going into the shadow period this week and we're going into the retrograde at the end, um, I would uh, start moving on some of this stuff because then things could become a process or actually, you know, start this up or whatever it is and then you can reevaluate it while it's um, while we're going through that. Also, I feel that the um, full moon eclipse um, 
it does form a yod is going to be very significant and here you are wow for some of you you're on this horse and that horse is up and you're like yay so i'm seeing some victory here something you know sweet little victory big maybe um this is for some of you you know depends on what's going on in your life um you have a spade going up so you could be resolving some kind of issue or ongoing uh, process whatever that is usually it's legal or litigation or documents or something business-wise that you're in there are people that want to let's see a little bit of miscommunication so you know there's just messages coming around everywhere you know and that's it. some of you are just so busy but the cup does not look bad at all and some of you could be coming to a little crossroads okay either you have two jobs and you may be um actually at a point where like okay I'm, i might have to quit one or some of you may take on another job but there's also a warning don't take on more than you can handle um don't bite off more than you can chew because <laughs> you're just going to stress yourself out but um if any of you are having you may be having some health issues or not real health issues just aches and pains here and there um headaches uh foot pain that day the next day it's fine a backache uh, next day it's fine you know things like that could be just bugging you a little um also it's saying get some sleep and i would your your intuition is um heightened too so I'd go by that, but that's all that I'm it's coming through. And remember, this is just um, for some cancers out there, not everyone. And there we go. And let's see. And this is your plate. And what it's telling me is, yeah, um, there is a release and a relief of something. But again, here, um, there's something you're keeping in or you're not disclosing it and it's telling me you should not um, it's better off to keep some things to yourself the reason is um, it's just some some things are not good to let out like if you're trying to work on something and build something in that um, sometimes less said about what you are doing is better than disclosing it till the right time because there's a sense of someone stealing an idea or going out there and just blabbing out things that you don't want said yet. So it's saying you're making the right decision, keeping some stuff to yourself. Okay. And also it's showing me that the full moon is going to make a significant turn of events um, for some of you. Okay, Cancer. So that is your reading for August 15th. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. And have a fabulous week. Love ya. Bye.